Hello everyone, welcome to this tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing you how to download Google Maps for offline view on any Android device. Without further ado, let me show you how you can do it. Before anything else, make sure you have the Google Maps downloaded onto your phone and you have connection to the internet. So do you have connection to the internet? If you do have, let's go to the next step. Now open the application, in this case Google Map, right here at the search bar, at the top right side, you have your icon. Click there, you will get access to this menu. Right down here, you have offline maps. Click there. If this is your first time like me, you might not have anything here, which is the same in my case. I don't have any map here that I have downloaded. So what we want to do now is to select a map and download. It will take us to this window and you can see here this squ blue square showing us the extent of the map where are you located and it shows us here, here at the bottom that the download will use up to 15 megabytes of your free space. So what it is telling us is that if you want to download this map it will download the area within this blue square line. For example, if you want to download beyond this area, what you have to do is using your fingers, zoom out from this area. As you can see, I'm zooming out, expanding the area for my download. And once you do that, it will automatically calculate the size of the map you want to download. For example, I had 15 before, now I have 20. And if for some reason you don't want to download this specific area, using just one finger, you can move around the map, going to anywhere you want, locating the place you want to download, for example, let me just find here Cape Town. For those who don't know, Cape Town is South Africa. I want to look for Cape Town right here. Now that I have found it, I'm just going to zoom in because I just, I want specific area of Cape Town as you can see now I'm zooming in using two fingers this is the area that I want to download and you can see here at the bottom it has updated the size of the map for to 25 megabytes and if that's okay with you click on download to download the map it will start downloading the map my internet is a little bit slow so I will leave it downloaded and come back once it finished While it is downloading, you will get this small arrow at the notification showing that something has been downloading. The download has finished, as you can see. And you can see right here at your map that you have expired date, which is 21st April 2022, which is next year. If you have Wi-Fi constantly enabled, this map will be updated automatically. But if you don't, and if you don't use this map often, this map will expire and will be deleted from your device. This happened in order to save space, but also happens because you're not using the map. Now here, if you go to the settings right here at the top on this gear icon, you have, can have access, more control over your offline maps. For example, you can auto update offline maps. So right here at the top, you can see that I have enabled out update offline maps. To save space and data, only recently used map will be updated. As you can see here, yeah, it's written down here. 
and also I have auto download recommended maps in this case for example if you go often to a certain region or if you travel a lot for a certain region and you have not downloaded that map because you don't need you will get a suggestion to download a map for that specific area or for example for in a place you are living it will give you a suggestion of your homeland to download that map and also you have here some control over the download preferences in this case i have mine set to offline or mobile network most of the time i like to keep it on over wi-fi only you know data mobile is expensive and i like to save as much as possible so keep there over wi-fi only all the time and then click save you have here storage preferences i like to save all the data on my device storage so that's okay and that's all in this section this is the settings that i use often and most of the time i don't change it so i keep it the way it is so once you have downloaded the map and you want to access the map that you have downloaded just click there and will take you directly to the map you here you have the option to rename the map by click on this pencil in this case i don't want you also have the option to delete or to update the map if you want you also if you want you can click here on the map to take you to this main window of the map where you can do the proper search on off if you want let me just show you what will happen for example let's say you don't have internet access i'm going to switch off here the wi-fi you have downloaded the map and it is offline your phone is offline you don't have mobile data and no wi-fi connection so what you want to do is come here to your icon go to offline map and then go to your map the map that you have previously downloaded download it click on there and then click again on the map to have access the map you take you to this window now here you can zoom in to get detailed information about the city or the place you want to go so as you can see the map you have downloaded it's perfectly working this is not cache information this is actually the map that you have downloaded you see it is working perfectly so guys that's all for this video this is how you download map on google maps so you can use it offline and if you have any question just leave that in the comment section i'll try to respond to you as soon as possible and i hope you've liked this tutorial and i hope you've learned something and if you did share this video subscribe to the channel like it and i'll see you in the next one ciao